Hi everyone, welcome to A for Autism. Today I am going to share one of the recent researches that I have come across and this research is really very interesting because it is about thyroid and how it is connected with autism. This research shows us that how important thyroid gland is. Actually, thyroid gland's main function is to secrete thyroid hormone which is responsible for maintaining blood pressure, our body temperature, also responsible for converting the food energy and properly deriving oxygen from it and getting it into our bloodstream. Now the research that I'm talking about, it says that if there is an imbalance of thyroid, whether it's decreased or increased and it is found in your child, then it can impact your baby's brain development. It is responsible for hyperactivity, lack of concentration, attention deficit. So exactly if you wish to check that how thyroid is impacted, there is a thyroid profile test that can be done. It will tell you all the levels T3, T4 and TSH, basically everything about thyroid gland. And if there is an imbalance, then definitely it should be ruled out. The research that I read mentioned that in kids with autism, generally hypothyroidism is found out and the levels of thyroid glands are either high or very low. If you wish to read that research, I will put a link in the description box. Please read that in details. Thyroid is usually hereditary. That means if there is any maternal or paternal side impacted by thyroid, then genes can be transferred into a child. But that does not mean that it is a mandate because for example, I have thyroid but my son did not have any thyroid traces in his blood which was recently checked. If you haven't gone through a TSH test yet for your child, I would sincerely request you to go ahead and get this done because I'm quite sure if there are traces of thyroid that are found in the test of your baby, then I think that your baby is impacted by thyroid and the autism traits that are showing up might get resolved or might actually reduce. As per the research that I have read, it is mentioned that hyperactivity and constipation are also two of the signs that mimic autism or you can say traits that mimic autism. So actually it will be a good practice if there is an imbalance found in your child's blood then it will rule out every possibility that was impacting his health. Many doctors try to rule out via MRI or EEG to get to know if there is a cause of autism. But if you get TSH profile done then this doubt that your baby was impacted by thyroid will also get relieved. Also it will be a big relief that whatever was causing a disturbance in your child's system was now being sorted out because thyroid actually disturbs the whole body. Once the medicine starts, thyroid's test is repeated after 3 months of time but also after few days if the thyroid level were extremely high and especially in kids they do a retest within 10 to 15 days to check whether the medicine is actually working and lowering down the levels or not. I would also request you Please avoid any experimental uh, medicines from homeopathy or Ayurved to, you know, uh, with the fear that I do not want to start the allopathic medicine. But please don't do that. Refrain to it and rather go to a thyroid specialist who can actually guide you, give you proper detail, proper medicine when the test should be done. Because what happens is when we start experimenting medicines, then it can create a reaction because our babies are pretty sensitive. They are very young and thyroid medicines from Ayurveda or from homeopathy might not work or create any reaction. Secretions from thyroid glands are actually important for every cell of our body and it actually impacts the growth and development and our brain as well. Before it's too late, get this test done. I hope this video will help our kids and the issues will get resolved. So kindly do let me know if there are any questions till we meet next time. Please take care of yourself. Bye.